Good day, world. I'm up. I've been up now for about an hour, just laying here in meditation mode. Mm, feeling that feminine energy where we get to that space of question. And I don't want to bask in this energy today, so I want to force myself to get up. And um, not a, allow myself to lie here in this energy because I need to keep my vibration high. Yet at the same time, accept the fact that I'm human and also accept the fact that the entire world is going through a major transformation. So because of that, I feel it. And when I feel it, I feel it first. And this is why I do what I do, because so many people in this world are hurting. And it takes my walk for me to be faithful enough and dedicated enough to Source to understand how important it is for me to be consistent with not lying there and basking in the energies of feeling lonely sometimes. It's okay. Because I've accepted the fact that it's not just me. It's the entire world right about now that's feeling lonely. It's the entire world that is in question about their path. So, with that being said, let's face the day and see what Source has in store for me. Because I'm sure it's just another day. If I can merely just accept these energies and put one foot in front of the other and trust that the universe is my boss and I'll be just fine. I got this. What up, y'all? I want to, um, I'm lazy as hell today. I don't like doing nothing. Look. Look at Chicka go. Whatever I do, do not drop my phone. Oh, snap. Flash on my neighbors. I got this big split on the side of my skirt. My dress. See? But this is a trip. Ain't that a trip? It's like all. Oh, that is deep. It's deep. Pretty deep. Well, there goes my river walk. I can't even see the river. Can I see the river from this window? You can see the ice a little bit. I can see down there. Oh, oh well. I think I'll do some readings for you guys if I feel like it. I'm being lazy today. Why not? I'm at home. It's not a hotel. I'm actually home. I love it. <laughs> this is deep. This reminds me of the movie The Swamp Thing. It's all foggy. There's some serious fog. Pretty deep. Huh. Oh wow. What in the world? Huh. Can the fog get a little thicker out there? Can they even see anything out there? It's pretty deep. Hit that light. The swamp thing must be out there somewhere, lingering in the swamp. The swamp thing comes to Chicago. That you could possibly think of, you think of swamp thing. 
What's wrong with the swamp thing? There's nothing wrong with it. As long as you don't come near me, you don't get jacked up. <laughs> yeah, right. You said that you're a swamp thing and you're going to let it take you out. I highly doubt it. I never said anything. I would say it's either I you say or the swamp thing. I'm not going to be like the people in the movie like, ah! And you'd be like, all right, buddy. It's going to be me and you in the swamp. We're nowhere near a swamp, mother. I know, but it looks like we're near a swamp. Pretty deep. Might as well be near a swamp. Oh God, I stayed in bed all day long. I was trying to go to the gym this morning, but I just did not feel like it. I was just so exhausted. It's like the move and going to the gym every single day since I've been here has kicked in and kicked my butt. Look, I still got these mattresses over here up against this wall. And I gotta figure it out because it's bugging me. I don't like stuff like that, left like that. And I gotta see where I'm gonna put my bed, if I'm gonna put it by the window or if I'm gonna put it by this wall because I have my desk coming. And that desk is like really pretty cool. But I don't, you know, once I get that bed, I'm not gonna be able to move that big old sucker by myself. So I have to do this right. So I have to figure this out now and um, figure out what's up with this air mattress and these mattress pads and at least try to get some DCC in order in this room in the meantime in between time just sharing gotta go peace bye okay so you guys want to see something very interesting watch me bless my butt try to move this mattress oh gosh I don't have no light in here why didn't I think of getting a lamp? Jeez. Seriously? I. Oh my god. Bathroom light's gonna have to work for now. Alright. Oh, so you're gonna laugh at me, huh? I don't even know what's going on. I I'm in here trying to move these mattresses because I want to see what. Sorry. Let's put my bed on. Oh, are you serious? This is plugged into the wall, so I can't. What the hell? Oh, you're just gonna exit the premises instead of helping, eh? Oh God, I'm Sagittarius. We don't ask for help. Then, then why is it a problem with me exiting the premises? Because you're my daughter. If you don't ask for help, you then just say, "Mom, do you need help?" I, I do. I do that at least okay. twenty-three six. So I'm not gonna lay in bed up against the wall. So what am I doing? All right, here we go. Let's figure this out. So let's see. Really? If you were just gonna mess with the bed again, why did you have me make it up? Are you serious? Right now? You seriously gonna be standing here talking smack and you see me fighting with these mattresses. Why don't you just yes. come on and help me then? Nothing. Since you'll have nothing else better to do. Actually, I do, but okay. Come help me, I can get it done faster. What do you need help with and what do you need? Why not you? Because I would rather watch a movie. You know what? Go ahead and watch a movie. I'll be in here by myself and I'll do it by yeah, myself. Alright, so you're just gonna stand there and try to put the beds together by yeah. yourself while holding up a freaking camera <laughs> yeah. because you want to become the next Kim Kardashian. No, uh, excuse me. I don't want to become the next Kim Kardashian. She could never touch my grounds. Don't ever insult my intelligence like that. Apologize. Was Apologize quick. I'm sorry that she, you want to become the next Kim Kardashian. No, I don't think so. Kim Kardashian, become the next Kim Kardashian. Are you serious right now? Well, then what are you trying to do? I'm trying to be myself, actually. Well, then be yourself, mother. And, and the people who I've met my whole like me. life couldn't accept me, then the whole world will accept me. But would it tell that Kim Kardashian get involved in this? Because you're doing the reality TV show. If I have Kim anything to do with Kim Kardashian, is it's, it's, it's laughing all the way to the bank like she did. That's about the only thing we have in common. Okay. That's about it. Anyways, while well, you busy over there talking shiznick, you know what? Fine. You're gonna want something to eat. Okay, look at that. You were jacking up the blinds. And then I gotta move the bed right, because if I don't move the bed right. Are you sure that you wanna have that over there in the corner where you're about to move stuff? Um, 
Yeah, because the guys who come from Z Gallery, they're white glove, which means that they do everything for you. No, I meant, are you sure that you want to put, okay, never mind, forget it. What? I was going to say, are you sure that you want to put the bed over here? Do you not want to move the camera somewhere else first? You serious right now? 100%. Okay, well then, move the camera then. Where do you want it to be moved, mother? That's why I asked you. <laughs> you told me not to hold it with your Kim Kardashian smart ass remarks. What if I call you that so Raven wanna be? Um, I'm pretty sure that I don't. I don't know where the heck you would get that from. Exactly, now you know how I feel. Why do you think that I would be like a Where the heck Kim would Kardashian you get that so even want to be from? That's where the hell would you get I'm a Ken Kardashian from? Because you're starting a reality TV show. There were reality TV shows it's before Kim like, Kardashian. I mean, like, Kim Kardashian is the most well-known one or something. I don't know. So what does she have to do with me? Because you're She's not even black. At least pick somebody black you can compare Does it matter what color their skin is? Okay, well. If you're just going to make a comparison. If you're not going to compare their skin, at least to, compare their brains. If you're going to make a comparison, is I made the comparison because of an interest in the same hobbies. Well, I made that the comparison the only reason why because you played on That's So Raven. <laughs> so since you're just that's because so I played done. on That's So Raven, like, I'm oh, pretty geez. sure that you know it doesn't what? even matter. Do I really have time for this right now? I don't know. You technically started this. No, I didn't start this. You started this by calling me a Kim Kardashian. I mean, again, technically, you started this. No, technically, I did not start this. Those are fighting words, actually. How are they fighting words? Because you called me somebody else outside of myself, first of all. First of I all. never said, hey, mom, you're Kim Kardashian. Anyways. Like I said, at least compare someone with the same brain. Oh, my bad. There's no one else on the planet like me. That's right, Mom. Now do you see, you know what? Are we know what? I see are where we gonna I take get the sarcasm from. You see where you get the sarcasm from? Can we just move the bed, please? I recommend we take the plastic off there. Okay. And then, uh, see, this is you and Jordan's thing. You guys like taking plastic off the bed. I mean, I don't know about you, but I don't like rolling over and hearing plastic. But they leave the plastic on just in case someone wets the bed. What if I wet the bed? <laughs> I doubt that you will. Okay, thanks but for letting if, me know. If, if you want to keep the plastic on, because there's a possibility of you wetting the bed. When I become a on. senior citizen, then we'll revisit this conversation. Sure, why not? You know what? You have the most interesting topics. I swear. Ah. What the? What the? You know what? Are you sure you want to keep this plastic for a prom dress? I'm 95% sure I'm not even going to prom, so. I don't think nobody went to prom. Everybody just went there and ditched it anyway, so you're not missing nothing. We walked through the door and showed our dresses off and everybody took off. Okay, so this bottom plastic, whatever, I don't think that, that has to be removed. Okay, so since you she right now and Superwoman, why are you flipping it that way? Because this part is apparently the bottom of the bed. Now, this one is the top, which you can tell because it has a whole bunch of designs on it. Well, what if I want the top gray? Then we'll turn the bed over. Okay, forget it. Never mind. So what if the headboard is too big for this corner? Well, where are we put it against that wall? No, I, I want to keep that wall because I want it. Why does it seem like this bed actually took up less room than that air mattress. You notice that? Oh yeah, I kind of did. Okay, so get your plastic prom dress off the floor. I, don't, I never I never accepted as a prom dress. So, so it was your prom dress plastic or something? Um, I don't remember. <laughs> then why, why, why was prom even brought up in the first place? I don't know. Okay, so are we gonna like, let this air mattress down or what? Do you want to put it on top of there? Because I thought yeah, that's what I just want to see what it looks like. Let's just put it on top of there. Because I may want to play for a few days. <laughs> you know what? Yeah. That was very epically high. I love that. Oh, yeah. Touch the sky. So, what is that plug to the side for? It's to blow up the air mattress, mother. That looks very fun. Yes, it does. It does. Let me check it oh, out. I don't know what it's like. Okay. Oh, yes. 
Why do you have to get this little blanket first? <laughs> because why not? It's soft. No. I don't really like that. I think I wish it was another mattress, but oh well. Or unless we just blow it up even tighter. We can. Well, yeah. Because I want to put the covers on first before you put the pillows on. Does that make sense? Honestly, no. I never understood why people do that because you're just going to take the pillows and put them under the covers. Okay, and here you go. Bed. That's a Raven Jr. I never accepted uh, being that's a Raven Jr. And I've never accepted wanting to be Kim Kardashian. Well, I'm not calling you Kim Kardashian. You did it. You did. Those I are said. Words. You're being like her. I never said, hey, mom, no, I'm you're being Kim like Kardashian. Myself. And you know darn well I'm being like myself. What have I well, ever thought I'm being like anybody? myself when I sarcastically talk? If, okay. <laughs> Jeez. Anyways, again. Mom, zero, Kenzie, one. Okay, if you want to win, fine. I was joking. If that's what makes you feel better. It doesn't. I, it makes no emotional difference. You just make sure you don't do this to me when I'm a senior citizen. I won't. I'm, I may be sarcastic, but I'm not a bad person. Because then you understand why I'm on vacation somewhere all the time. Okay. Okay, what? I, I, I just said okay. Do I have to say more? What? Put on my cards in are you going to put this back in there? Yeah, I'm going to actually use that as a car stand. Ooh. And then we're putting skeletons everywhere. I remember when I was like I love six it. and we were in a store and I picked up this shirt that had skeletons on it and you said that I couldn't get it. That's not bad. Hmm, do we need that headboard after all? That sucker was like 2K. But that's cool. I deserve it. We just have to let this air mattress down, but now I see what the the gel mattress is going to look like when I get it. So, that's all good. Anyways, thanks for helping me. You're welcome. That's a Raven Jr. Uh, okay, you're welcome, Kim Kardashian. You know what? Don't even start it. You st Okay. You're going to want something very soon. I mean, I already asked you for something. You said you'll think about it. Well, I'm still thinking about it, and you're helping me think about it right now. I love you, too. I love you, too. Thanks. All right, so uh, my question is, what the heck? <laughs> What kind of picture is that? <laughs> okay, I got my little setup. I'm about ready to go live. So with my camera all blurry and stuff. Gotta fix that. Hello, Mr. Skeleton. How are you today? You ready to go live? Okay, let's go play. Okay, everyone, this concludes another episode of The House of L. OMG, look how foggy it is out here. You can't even see the building in front of me. You can't even see down there, can you? Oh, there's no telling what's up with Chicago. Very interesting, though. Good night, everyone. See you on the next episode of The House of L. Pieces.
Hmm, kind of like in my bed. Ghetto fabulous, indeed. I may not need that mattress after all. Kind of like this air mattress up here. Hmm. Oh well. Good night, everyone. I'm going to bed. <laughs>